All right, so I got the crankshaft pulled. I used the, I didn't use a pulley to get the gear off. Um, it took a little bit, but I don't know if that is from that or not. But um, I think I'm going to replace these bearings. Anyhow. Trying to get a focus here. Can't really. I don't know why I'm not getting a better focus. Anyways. So that's that. I'm kind I mean, I don't know why, but if you look at that, when I read in the service manual, I thought it said that those, they can be up to half the oil holes right there. It said they can be up to halfway covered. But I also thought that that bearing was, oh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's the, maybe I was thinking about the camshaft bearing. I thought it was supposed to be in further, but no, it's smooth on both sides. I'm not seeing. Anything bad in here? Camshaft seems to look fine. Obviously, I still have the valves in. All right, so there's that. And here. See, I'm not sure if that is from me taking it out or what, but it looks, I mean, they're definitely worn. I don't know if I see anything that would warrant assuming the crank bearing is Causing the knock. Here's the seal. What do you guys think of the seal? Think that needs to be replaced? Doesn't seem too bad. So flexible. Like some rubbery still. Oh, but look at that. It might be a good idea to replace it. That's the only spot like that. Doesn't seem like it. But still, so there's that. Sorry about the garbage trucks going by. And here is the crank.
Let's take a look one at a time. So this is the front end. You see those little discolored areas? Like they go all the way across. I'm not sure. Not the set, not the spot in the center, but on either side of that, because that's obviously where the oil channel was or whatever. Right, goes all the way through. But it, I'm not sure if those are spots. that are causing issues or that are the signs of issues or if that's just normal wear there's a good one right there above the, the shiny spot it's just dirty I think maybe not There's that. If they're not egg shaped, it might not hurt to get them cleaned up, that's for sure. But it'll be hard to tell if they are until you get a caliper on them. Attaches to the generator flywheel or blower wheel. So that's that. I mean, all the way through, also nice and clean, looks like. So I don't know. Um, I'm gonna run it up to the shop. I'd like to run it up there later today, but I don't, or, you know, I don't even think I could. The guy's gone at four, so it's kind of pointless. So I don't know. We'll see what everybody says and go from there. Gasket looks okay, but I'll probably order a new one. May as well. I tried some of this gasket paper on the oil pan. Uh, but I'm not sure. It seemed like it was almost leaking from there. So I'm definitely going to get one of those. It just seemed like wet. That. And that was all, I believe it was all dry when I put it back together. I do remember. the bottom after I cleaned it with some WD-40 and then wiping that off just so it didn't start instantly rusting but that's the oil pickup pump seems fine
So that's pretty much it. So reflections. All right. Um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna take it up to the shop and see what they say as far as specs. So, all right, thanks.